hyper local website bringing communities even closer together. Five Eyewitness News reporter Joylyn Nakrin tells us about Commonplace. Alan Bankston has lived in Burnsville for all of his 37 years, but is now meeting neighbors he never knew he had. When I was first growing up here, the, the population, it wasn't as big as it was today. When he needed a babysitter for his six-year-old and three-year-old sons earlier this month, he turned to Commonplace. Went on the website, uh, was able to ask if anyone knew of a great babysitter. Within an hour, his 14-year-old neighbor, Joy Adams, replied. So I went to Commonplace's website, and they... I saw the post that he needed a babysitter. Joy and Alan are just two of the nearly 600 users on Burnsville's Commonplace site. Essentially, Commonplace is an online community bulletin board. It is geographically um, targeted here in Burnsville. Commonplace is now in 10 American cities, including two in Minnesota. City leaders in Burnsville and Golden Valley helped establish the site in their towns in October. I've been always looking, always looking for tools that engage our community. And this particular one really meets that. Users say it's a great, great way to build new relationships and to nurture older ones. To be able to spend an extra night with my wife, you know, going to see a movie, um, yeah, it's beneficial. So, uh, yeah. Now, if Commonplace is successful, organizers plan to expand to other cities, and they're already eyeing Egan, Apple Valley, and Lakeville. Reporting live, Joy Lim Nakrin, 5 Eyewitness News.